Okay, this is my first solar panel that I built. First time I tried it. Um, you can see the air bubbles. Right there, the panels. That's still dripping down. Now this is going on. Let's see. This is the second or third day since I poured that sly guard in there. See, I have some air bubbles. Ideally, it would look like this bottom corner panel. With no air bubbles, but this is my first attempt at this. Uh, I think next time I could probably do a little better job. But the panel works fine. Uh, putting out good voltage. My aluminum frame cost me $14 for the aluminum. 36 of those cells, I believe it came out to like $81 or $86. And the slide guard was uh, just under $50. And the slide guard is the, the silicone that you, the liquid silicone that you pour into uh, to seal the cells on the front and the back side. Now, I poured the slide guard and then after it kind of set up, I threw wax paper on there, and then I, I laid boards on the back um, to kind of hold the cells down flat. I didn't do that exactly right away, but I think if I would have, it might have been, might have been a little better. I just want to show you that. You can see that the slide guard is dripping down right here yet, so it isn't completely set up in there yet. I'm actually hoping that that wheels go down. I was kind of hoping that these air bubbles might work their ways up. And I don't think it's going to happen on these. Anyway, so I'd take a little video of this. Pretty happy the way this one turned out. This is a two foot by four foot. Actually, the frame is 22 feet wide, or 22 inches wide. I take that back. It's, it's outside dimensions are two feet by four feet. And the next one will be made out of the glass from this panel. I'm gonna switch this panel out put just a slightly narrower glass in it and steal that glass. My next solar panel will be that big, which is 73 inches by uh, 31 inches, I believe it was, or 30, 30 and 3 quarters, one or the other. 